and welcome back everyone to ABC 25 Local Lifestyles. Well, it is almost time for the Evansville Philharmonic Orchestra's Young Artist Competition. It's actually coming up this Sunday, so it really is uh, almost time. And Brian Underdonk is with us from the orchestra this morning. Um, this event is a pretty big one for you guys, and it's been around for a while. Yeah, this is actually the 63rd wow. year that this has been around. That's and, impressive. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So kind of tell us a little bit about it if, if people haven't kind of been to it and, and where the idea came about. Sure. Um, well, it's an opportunity for uh, any high school aged kids okay. in uh, the tri-state area or uh, within a 150 mile radius of within Indiana to perform on the stage of the Victory Theater. Uh, they will uh, be on the stage in front of an audience with judges and they will perform a movement of a concerto and uh, the winner gets a chance, gets a cash prize and a chance That's to awesome. perform with the Evansville Philharmonic uh, in 2021. So are there any um, things, specific things other than their age to be eligible for this? Do they have to live in the tri-state you said? Uh, yeah, they, they have to be uh, in, in the area. Okay. Um, they just need to be able to play their instruments well, really exactly. well. Yeah. <laughs> How many um, competitors do you have for we the competition? Have, we have year? about 12 okay. coming this year. Uh, each of them gets 12 minutes to stand up on stage and do their very best That's for the judges. That's quite a long time to be it, up there on stage, it, it, isn't it? It, it can be. Yeah. It's a, a little bit intimidating, especially when you're on the stage all by yourself. Oh, right, with that <laughs> it's whole a big, stage. big on it. Yeah, <laughs> and you kind of have to fill up that whole big area. Yeah, it's uh, it's it, it can be a little intimidating. Some of them walk out, but then, you know, once you get out there mm -hmm. and you play your instrument and yeah. you do your thing, uh, most of them you just kind of, yeah. you're in your own you're, yeah, zone Exactly, there, so. you're performing. Yeah. And you have judges. Do you, um, how many judges are there for this? We have three judges. Okay. Uh, they're a uh, member, two of them are members of the Philharmonic, okay. uh, our most senior members of the Philharmonic. And uh, one of them is the conducting uh, faculty, is on the conducting faculty of the University of Evansville. Okay. So, so even if you don't win, like getting yourself in front of those kind of people, yeah, you know, uh, could it's mean a, a lot. It's a fantastic experience yes. because, um, you know, Especially when you're in high school, you don't really have that much of an opportunity exactly. to perform on a large stage mm -hmm. in front of an audience. In this case, we'll have an audience there. Uh, it's free and open to the public. Which and is awesome. Wants to come by, yes. Yeah, so anybody can come. Tell yes, everybody please. again when it is on Sunday. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so it'll be uh, Sunday at the Victory Theater, mm -hmm. downtown Evansville, uh, 2 o'clock p.m. Uh, go till about 5 o'clock p.m. when we will announce the winners on stage, live, for everybody there. Uh, please come on down. It's uh, the more the merrier, as far as I say. And then do you know when the winner would perform with the uh, Philharmonic the, yeah, Orchestra? The, the winner will perform on the 2021 uh, Young People's Concerts, which are okay. always in uh, March. So this year, in 2020, when we do our Young People's Concerts, is the winner from last year gotcha. will be performing. Gotcha. So then do they, I guess they rehearse quite a bit, too, Oh yeah. to get oh, ready yeah. for that. Yeah. No, they it's, win. it's a big deal. It's yeah. a big deal. So yeah, they get to rehearse with the orchestra. And, and, and I was curious too, um, like what you see previous winners, you know, because we've you've been doing this for a long time. Yeah. Do you see them in the orchestra? Do you see them moving on to, you uh, know, other things? Many of them, uh, you know, I find out years later, I find out that they're playing <laughs> with some big uh, symphony orchestra mm -hmm. somewhere. Uh, many of them go on to big uh, music schools such as Juilliard or Indiana right. University, wow. uh, you know, so this is a big stepping stone for many of them. So if somebody has a young you know, student that they think you know, has the talent to do this, if they want to, can't really get in for this year again, right? I mean, we're, yeah. this is coming up on Sunday, but if they wanted to look into it maybe for next year, how do they go about becoming a contestant? Uh, they just need to go to the Evansville Philharmonic website. The, all the information is on there, or they can give me a call okay. uh, uh, with the Philharmonic. I'm always happy to talk to anybody who's yes. interested in coming. All right, and there is the information uh, on what's coming up this Sunday. Again, it's the Young Artist Competition, Sunday at 2 o'clock at the Victory Theater. It's free, so, you know, bring your kids, come on out, and then how long will that take on Sunday to go through uh, a, the 12? A few, a few hours. Okay. Uh, it'll be about two, uh, two some odd hours for the contestants, and then the judges deliberate, and then okay. we'll announce it around 4. So you will announce the winner, so we you'll will. get to see before... You, we uh, will have a winner by right. the end of the day. By the end of the day. Awesome. Thank <laughs> you. My pleasure. So my